Okay guys, so I went ahead and lost it again into the vortex of front porch. <laughs> I seriously don't even know what happened. I think I have about four combined orders here. Just every day she put something up that I was like, that sounds good. So anyways, I'm just going to get onto it. I'll I do have to say this order, everything that I have sniffed so far, I absolutely love. So that's a plus. I had, you know, sometimes I order and I just don't love everything, you know, I kind of just, sometimes I just go and try different things and I end up not liking them. So yeah, so I think this time I did a pretty good job. So there's her business card. And the turnaround time at Front Porch is, they are ready to ship, but it takes, I mean, I don't think I've ever waited r really long. Um, I think it says seven to 10 business days for her to ship, but I don't know that I've waited that long. So she, I mean, she's always putting up lots of new scents. So there's always a good variety and she seems to be doing a, a good job also of putting up Christmas type scents and then also other scents, you know? It seems like around this time of year, there's a lot of fall and winter. And it's just nice that she kind of mixes it up. So that's good. And what else is I going to say? I feel like there was something I was going to say. I don't know. I just, I like her selection and I like her tart. So, and she's easy to order from. So, oh yeah, that's what I was going to say is you can order like three days in a row and she'll ship all three orders together. So, and there's free shipping. And I think if you spend $25 or more if you punch in front porch in the discount code it'll give you 10% off so that's always nice so and I'm, I'm getting off to a bad start here because I did not write down scent descriptions or anything so I'm just gonna kind of go off the cuff here but the first grubby tart I got is in pink chill and I think if I remember correctly this is some sort of pink sugar with I almost smell like a mint in here in with it. If I remember to check, I'll put the description in the frame somewhere here. But yeah, that one's a good one. Uh, so I've really been into laundry, pink sugar lavender laundry. Sorry, I'm kind of shaky here. Let's see if I can... Okay, this is heavier on the laundry and I'm not smelling a lot of the pink sugar and lavender right off the bat. But we'll see, you know, when you warm it up, it could change. I got two of the eggnog cupcakes. And this one, okay, so I had um, ordered some cup, um, cupcakes. I'd ordered some eggnog scents from her previously and I was having this weird like after note like kind of like when you sniff into a bottle of like hard alcohol. I was getting this after scent but mixed with the cupcakes I'm not getting that anymore. This one should be really nice. Nice and sweet. Good scent. Calm Sea was one that I was just I don't know I just randomly kind of picked that and this is an ocean scent. Yeah, just an oceany scent. I don't have a lot of lime in my collection. You know, just plain lime, like mixed with something. So I got lime cookies. This one is actually really good. The lime is nice. It's not like overly bitter or anything. And you just get the sweetness from the cookies. So I really, really like that one. This one is Cranberry Vanilla Laundry. I feel like I've hauled this one before, but I feel like I wanted a second one, so. Nice, sweet cranberry. The laundry isn't the less dominant note in this one. That one, I just, I really like that one. Nice, sweet cranberry with laundry just kind of in the, there's a lot of wax. One thing about her wax is it is really soft. Pink Eucalyptus Spearmint. I feel like I heard Angie talking about this one. I think it was Angie. This is actually a eucalyptus spearmint that I could handle. And she, I, I believe it was her, and I believe that she liked this one. And um, this is a good one. If you are not a eucalyptus spearmint lover, like I, I'm not a big fan of it alone, 
but mixed with the pink sugar, it's doable and it's actually kind of nice. Kind of a nice switch from the, from the norm. If you're a big bakery person, it's like a nice fragrance. Okay, so Cake Shop Cupcakes. I got this in the four pack grubbies and this is really, really sweet. I wanna say this is a mix of Aunt Angie's fam Famous Cupcakes and Cake Shop. Again, I'll have to look on that, but this is super sweet. Good one. Okay, this next one was influenced by my random favorite things. She raved about clover and aloe. And I freaking love this scent. I cannot believe, like, I was like, oh my gosh, okay, she's like really over-exaggerating and, you know, I'm probably going to get it and I'm going to hate it, but oh my gosh. I don't even know what to say about this, but I might need to go see if she has a four... <laughs> a four pack of this because this is such a good like clean not like lemon clean or you know like cleaner clean but just outdoorsy like I don't even know I don't know that I would know what a clover and aloe would even smell like I feel like aloe has no scent ah but that is just so beautiful I seriously need to go back and see if there's more of this. I can't really describe it. You just have to try it for yourself and I would recommend if you like spa or like fresh scents, that's a good one. Next up, I got can cotton, can candy cotton pink lilac, sorry. And I'm trying to jump out of my norm of just getting bakery and trying some flowery floral type scents. And this is a good segue because it's not lilac dominant but you can smell it in there but it's got the sweetness of the cotton candy and I think the pink sugar to kind of mix it up, which is, is what's so um, cool about, you know, wax vendors is they can mix things. Okay, so this one is Snuggling Under the Stars and Pink Sugar. This one is pink sugar dominant to me. I'm not really sure what the Snuggling Under the Stars is, but I remember it sounded good to me on the description. But I, I don't know if I can detect it in here. I'm just getting really a lot of pink sugar. Those chunks are crazy. Okay, next one is lemon pound cake. I've been obsessed with lemon and she has a really good one. That is just like the perfect lemon bakery scent. I almost like that better than the lemon marshmallow, I think. And I really like lemon marshmallow. Yeah, that one's good. Okay, lavender blackberry cookies. I don't remember trying anything blackberry from her, so I really wanted to try. This one may not be my favorite, but it's not bad. I'm getting blackberry, slight, slight blackberry. And then it's like the lavender is in there, but I can't tell if it's like a sugary lavender or herbal or mid-road. And I don't know if I can smell the cookies. That one's interesting. Hard to describe that one. Okay, pink chiffon. Oh wait, did I do that one? Did I do pink chiffon cotton candy cookies? I don't know. I don't think I did. Okay. <laughs> I am losing it. My, I think my, st I, my stomach, I can hear it growling. Hopefully that's not translating onto the camera, but. Pink chiffon cotton candy cookies. That one's a little bit lighter to me, but smells good. I'm not the biggest fan of pink chiffon. I'm not really sure why I ordered that one. I thought maybe mixing it with the cotton candy and cookies would kind of change it up a little bit. So it's not bad. Okay, and the next chunk, a uh, big chunk, I did vanilla laundry and so much laundry because I like the laundry scents. And that is like laundry all the way. I'm barely getting the vanilla laundry in that either. So, that one is good. Okay, so this one. So much laundry, citrus laundry, pink mallow laundry. This one's really good. I love the citrus that's coming out of there. 
the pink marshmallow. Mm, and that's so much laundry. It's just all three of them mixed. Just really, if you like laundry and if you like your laundry kind of mixed with stuff, this is really good. Ah, I think I'm set for laundry scents for a while, I think. I ordered a lot from Front Porch. Okay, so this one is Kiss Me at Midnight, Pretty Day, and Tiki Paradise. Now, I'm not sure. I was trying to read the descriptions of these, and they sounded intriguing. And it's a lot of floral, not heavy floral, but just an interesting floral. Does that even make sense? I'm, I'm, what I'm trying to say is it's not like it's going to like throw you out of the room floral like super strong, but almost kind of smelling like a water note. I think that Tiki Paradise is like a, um, like a coconut beachy type scent. I don't know, I'm going to have to look up scent descriptions and see, because my nose won't tell me. Okay, so then I got all those, and then she uploaded some scuba bowls, and I always like the six ounce because they're just like the perfect size. And they come wrapped in these cute little bags. And then what she does is she ties a ribbon around them and then she gives you the lid separately so like I said I've been looking for lemon type scents so I got lemon buttercream cookies and this is so so perfect this is like the perfect lemon lemon bakery goodness it almost smells like a donut with like lemon icing on top mmm that just smells so good so that will be perfect for like the kitchen. And then I got this one for the bathroom because we have, um, I find that these work really good in Scentsy warmers. So in the um, Scentsy wall plug-in, I'm going to use this linen extreme. And this one is not overly dominant on limit, linen as like laundry as I thought it was going to be. This one is actually really pretty. Kind of lighter than what I would ex um, expect. But we'll have to see how that one throws. And then last, I needed cookies and cupcakes. That one's super sweet as well. Just smells like a bakery, actually. Ah, oh, that one's good. So there's that. So that is everything that I got. Like I said, I think I placed one more smallish order like for like two things. Because, yeah, I just needed two more things. Like I really needed anything, but um, I'm going to check out this clover and aloe. Holy crap. I need to see if there's more. So that one is really nice. Really like that one. That's a, that's a good, good choice. Anyway, so I think let me just double check and make sure. Yep, that's everything, you guys. And um, thank you guys so much for watching. And if you have any front porch hauls, um, if you'd comment down below, I'd love to go watch them. And thank you guys so much for watching, and I will talk to you later. Bye.